First of all, great to talk to you. Thank you for your time. You know, this is a serious situation. We know people are still reeling financially from the pandemic. Heating costs are also rising. Potentially, how many residents were in need of financial assistance and still are, especially as we look ahead to the grace period for utility shutoffs ending? The actual number is astronomical. And I'm gonna give it to you actually in dollars and cents, over $650 million in arrearages uh, to the various uh, utilities throughout the state of New Jersey. We're talking about from water bills to electric bills, gas bills, um, and, 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 and folks are really. That number is really astronomical and getting the word out about these programs is critical. So you have one program to help, it's the USF program. Now that's been temporarily expanded to provide more assistance. Tell me about that. The USF is part of our Fresh Start program and it provides um, unlimited forgiveness uh, of overdue uh, electric and or gas bills. Uh, for any USF participant with an overdue balance of $60 or more. Uh, Fresh Start customers uh, need to pay uh, their uh, current bill in full each month for 12 consecutive months to earn full forgiveness on pre-existing pre -existing, uh, overdue bills. I also want to make sure we mention the Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program because this program as well, the income eligibility has been expanded. And this is really a key program that helps a lot of people in the state. That's the Low Income uh, Home Energy Assistance Program. Uh, and uh, it's a federal program. Uh, this helps uh, households at or below 60% of the state median income of $77,272 for a family of four. And we'll pay for eating costs, electric gas, deliverable fuels, um, emergency grants uh, to prevent uh, service shutoffs. So if you're making $6,400 plus uh, uh, 39, 600, uh, or $6,439, you can qualify for LIHEAP assistance. That's gone up almost uh, over $2,000. Is there any chance that the grace period could be extended again? That currently is not under discussion, uh, Rhonda, but I, I guess anything is, is possible. President Fiordaliso, it's been a pleasure speaking with you. Thank you.